Hey, today I wanted to cover a really cool application called Explain Everything. And you can use Explain Everything kind of like a virtual whiteboard. So this would be really useful in like projecting it over AirPlay uh, to your projector. So let's go ahead and get started. So to begin, you'll come to uh, this screen right here. And uh, we're going to go ahead and hit the plus in the upper left hand corner to start a new project. Uh, so here's a couple of basic templates that you can have. Uh, you can see the uh, big squares with the smaller rectangles on the inside. Uh, the background of the large rectangle is the background uh, of your screen. And then the three colors are the colors of your default pens. Of course, you can select other pens once you get in. So we're just going to go ahead and select the white background that's on the left here. So this is what it looks like um, as the blank uh, beginning template. Uh, you can see this option right here uh, well, is a pen. This option right here is a highlighter. This option right here uh, is a shape such as arrows and rectangles. And we'll get into all this here in, in just a second. This option right here will allow you to type. This option right here will allow you to actually import like a picture uh, or a video and you can annotate it on the fly. You got an eraser right here, a laser pointer right here. This option right here lets you reverse the last thing that you did. That'll let you zoom in more. This option right here will allow you to hide your menus and expand them out. And here are the colors of your default pens. However, if you hold down on it, you can select other colors. Pretty much anything you want to come up with. You select here in your little color wheel. This option right here is your slides. Now you can go and uh, move from slide to slide. So if I wanted to create another one, I could hit the plus and it would give me a blank one. Or I could go back to my first one here. And here, this will allow you to record your presentation. Uh, not only does it record what you draw on the screen, but it will also record your voice. And then this option over here, this will allow you to export your project. So if you want to create a video uh, to help your students with like an e-learning lesson or something like that, uh, you can use that to export it. So let's go ahead and let's import a sample sheet that I created. I go into my photos. I just took a picture of my spreadsheet. It's not great, but that's what we have to work with right here. Uh, so I'll select it and hit done. And that will bring it into the Explain Everything application. Uh, so from here, you could like go through the worksheet with the kids if you wanted. Uh, if you wanted to point something out, you could select um, this option right here and let's say we want to get an arrow. So we'll grab the arrow and you can say, okay, let's, let's do this question right here. Let's do this one right here. So you can do that kind of thing. Uh, so also, if you write, you can go over here, select your eraser, and then just using your pen like a regular eraser, you can erase what you've written. Use this option right here as your laser pointer. You can select that and then you see the little red dot. As long as you poke your pen on the screen, you can move it around. So you can say, oh, right here or right here. So it's pretty, pretty nice. You can select something to type by hitting the little A right here. Putting our box and Right words. So let's go ahead and we'll uh, we'll make a sample recording here. So we'll go down here and we'll hit the record button. Okay, we'll go ahead and stop it. So now I'll hit the play button and you can just see the video that I made. Of course, you can record it a okay. lot longer we'll go than ahead this and stop. too. You can record it a lot longer than this too. That's just a, a sample example. And then say you want to uh, export this, you can go ahead and save your project. And we'll just call this uh, test explain. And I'm just going to export this to my photo, but obviously you could export it to anywhere you wanted, like Google Drive or, or something like that. All right, 
the video has finished. Now we can go into our camera roll. And here is the video. Okay, well, we'll go ahead and stop it. Like I said, you can also import like a picture in here. So here I took a picture of me just to play with. I'll make my, my beard a little bigger here. So as you can see, there are just all types of things that you can do with this application that are very useful. So I hope this helped you to figure out how to, to use this application and just thanks for watching.